to learn a method, a new method based on Vedic maths. This is called the cross method of multiplication. We all know a conventional method, a two digit number. If I multiply, it will come in three lines. First, I'll multiply this number, then with this number, and finally add it up. I get the answer in the third line. It will take at least two minutes, however good we are. But let's do away with the intermediary steps and derive the answer in just one line. We can achieve it only with a calculator. But if you know Vedic Maths, this will help you in getting the answer in just one line. Let's see. We will follow this rule. If you have noted it, it goes like a straight line, a cross and a straight line. We'll apply the same trick over the numbers. Three ones are. We all know three ones are is three. Second step, six ones are six. Four threes are twelve. I got a six from here, a twelve from here. If I add it up, I get an eighteen. I can't write full eighteen. I'll carry the balance one. Six fours are because it says last step is a straight line. Six fours are. I multiply. Six fours are twenty-four and one balance. 25. My full and final answer is 2583. Let's see an, another example. I'm multiplying these numbers. This will work with any two-digit two-digit number. No restrictions. Like in special cases, we had special numbers. We had the first digit should be the same. The last digit should add up to a 10. But here, any two-digit number, it will perfectly work. Five ones are five. Seven fives are 35. Plus eight gives me a forty-three. Seven eights are fifty-six. When I add up the balance four, I get a sixty. My final answer is six zero three five. Let's see another example. I'm multiplying thirty-three into ninety-one. My aim is to do it in one line, in one step, instead of many steps. How to do it fast in one single step? First step is three ones are three. Twenty-seven. If I multiply this side and three from this side, twenty-seven plus three adds up to a thirty. Nine threes are gives me twenty-seven. Twenty-seven plus three is another thirty. So my final answer is three zero zero three. Remember this, children. We have to solve it in seconds. Our aim is to do it in fast manner. For this in maths, have a extra edge over your tables. You should be knowing your tables thoroughly. When you see the number, you should tell six, twenty-one and eight, twenty-nine, twenty-eight and two, thirty. A two-digit number shouldn't take more than five ten seconds, according to me. Okay, very easy. Apply it, and it can be done in seconds.